What matters today? Niagara in the morning with Tim Dennis. News Talk 610 CKTB. It begins Sunday, and you could, some people may not care at all about the game. They just want the, uh, the whole spectacle of the thing. They may wait for the halftime show. Uh, it's, uh, for our friends in the U.S., it's an unofficial national holiday. As the 54th edition of the Super Bowl pits the 49ers against the Chiefs. Hard Rock Stadium in Miami. Uh, that's the home of the Dolphins. And um, I guess for most of us, it's just an excuse to get together with people and and really just socialize. Because I don't see an awful lot of people going out of their way to be 49ers fans or Chief fans at this point. Maybe years ago, but not now. So... That having been said, you need something to make for your friends when they come over. And uh, my next guest I haven't talked to in a while. Uh, it's been much too long. Kim, how are you? Kimberly Turner. Uh, I'm well. Hi, Tim. How are you? I've missed you. I know. It's been a long time. we gotta, we got to put an end to this. Let's, let's do this more often. I've been, I've been busy momming. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's a full, full, full-time job. She, she's very busy, yes? How old is she now? <laughs> She's 20 months. Wow. Yeah, no. She's a very busy 20 months. No wonder I haven't talked to you in a while. <laughs> uh, let's let's talk a little bit about, I mean, some people want to tailgate. Um, I guess that's the classic football thing. But other people just want to get together in their homes. Let's start up with some ideas for Sunday, Kim. All right. Well, let's talk about apps, the mains, some desserts, and some bevies, because that's pretty much what you're looking at. Right. Um, so how about we do some classic stuff? Potato skins, but let's do them fun. How about we make them pizza potato skins? Ooh. Or you could put burger inside of it, shove it in there in the hole, and then bake it. Um, I did crab and smoked Tavardi stuffed new potatoes, and that was fabulous, too. Um, you can check out one of my new shows is stuffed pineapple with a shrimp and scallop, shrimp and scallop salad. That'll keep everybody happy, the, the women and the men. Um, or you can use melons. You can stuff melons. Uh, meatball and fruit skewers, you can mix and match lamb, beef, chicken. You can put all kinds of fruit on there. Uh, grilled prosciutto wrapped shrimp skewers. Those are beautiful. <laughs> you, like need, that. you need man wings, not just chicken wings. Let's do turkey wings. Sweet and spicy honey mustard turkey wings. Um, you could use puff pastry uh, for your pizzas instead of regular pizza dough. Uh, and then you could do pizza rolls, pizza rolls or pizza pinwheels. And then put them on a stick. I would do it after you bake them. Uh, beer battered chicken fingers. Can oh. You can make your own candied almonds and beer nuts. That's a nice idea. Um, that's pretty good. You guys are going to be really full on those apps. So let's move on to the main. Okay, just um, but just before we move ahead, we will give you um, a, a, a place that you can go and get these recipes at the oh, end, right? Absolutely, okay. yes. Okay, all right. Because yep. just, just people are going, oh, that went too fast. I need details on this. Okay. I'm just trying to get it all in so yep. you guys know what the menu is. Okay, <laughs> on we go. Uh, you can check out the show I've done on a, I did a big, giant bull, barbecue pulled pork leg. It was about 27 pounds. Um, Rogan Josh on the grill. So I did a beautiful special curry on there. It was unbelievable. And you can either just use the meat like that or you can put it on sandwiches. Okay. Uh, baked, make baked pasta like a macaroni or a ziti or something. Tomato sauce, chorizo, green pepper. Bake that up, and everyone will be happy with that. Beef and pretzel burgers. Crush up some pretzels. Instead of using breadcrumbs, use pretzels or chip crumbs. Those are fabulous. And top your burgers with salsa. That's more fun. And then I thought mammoth beef ribs. So if you make your beef ribs, right, they're yeah. all finished. Yeah. And then you wrap them in phyllo and put them back in the oven for, you know, just a little while to brown that phyllo up. And then you've got these mammoth beef ribs. They're pretty cool. Um, and if you're looking to do something maybe a little bit healthier, try skinless chicken drummies, you know, instead of using the skin on, take the skin off and maybe, you know, power pack it with some flavors, teriyaki, for instance, or something you could do a poutine pizza. That's fun. You could either use the French fries or potatoes for the crust or use a regular pizza dough and then top it with, you know, gravy and the cheese curd. That's very all Canadian. Yep. Very Canadian. <laughs> um, yeah. 
Beer and oxtail stew, that's always good. I know that you said all you want is chips and beer, Tim. Yeah, I know. That, I'm, I have no imagination, can you? <laughs> okay. Well, how about we go to dessert then? Uh, chocolate chip pretzel cookies. Football oh, cookies. Okay. Make them in the shape of, of footballs. You can add M&M's, your favorite color of your team that may not be in the Super Bowl, or just put red, red M&M's in. Yep. Um, you can make fruit pizzas. So get a big, giant watermelon, cut it into slices, and top it with really interesting other kinds of fruits and they look really cool and the kids are happy with that grab a pineapple they're really cheap in the stores right now cut them up throw it on the grill with some cinnamon you are really grand and then let's talk about beer yeah yeah (laughs) yeah okay so there's a lot of really cool craft beers out right now especially at the lcbo and you know or you can go grab some microbrewery beers so if you just want to go plain and simple that way or you can make shandies you know, the ladies like shandies. Shandies are tasty. So try, you know, my favorite thing, blood orange, Tim. Yes, it is. So grab some blood oranges. You can make some blood orange shandies. Um, or margaritas. Everybody's happy with margaritas. You can have a margarita bar, frozen, on the rocks, whatever, and grab some tropical fruit. People can make their own. You can spike some cider. Grab some apple cider. Um, they can either add it in their beer or you can spike it with liquor or, you know, you can already grab cider that is spiked. So that's kind of cool, too. Or you can just rim your glass for something different. So grab some peanut butter or Nutella or some other kind of nut butter and then crush nuts and put it on there and then frost the glasses. Or try caramel on the rim and then put some coarse sea salt. That's kind of cool. That's tasty with beer. And it's almost Valentine's Day. So you're going to be able to find all kinds of cool, you know, cinnamon, hot cinnamon candies. Crush those up and put that on your rim. Those are nice. And then just have some really great Caesars. Wow. Everyone likes a Caesar. Yep. And there, there is a billion ways to make Caesars these days. There is all kinds of cool ways and all kinds of cool vegetables and pickled vegetables to put in. So yep. that's what I'm thinking, Tim. How about you, you? You got a ton in there. Now, you got to let people know where they can find all of this, Kim. Um, you can find my shows on YouTube.com, uh, Cooking with Kimberly. I'm on Hideout TV, uh, Cooking with Kimberly. You can find my website at CookingWithKimberly.com. And I'm all over social media. Just look up Cooking with Kimberly. Kim, we'll do this again real soon. Awesome. Thanks. Miss ya. Uh, you too. We'll, we'll talk because we got Valentine's Day coming up, so we'll put together some romantic dinners for folks. Perfect. Sounds good, Kim. Have, have a great time on the weekend. You too. Kimberly Turner, uh, Cooking with Kimberly. You can find her all over the place.